You're watching the award-winning WTOC-TV, Channel 11, the Southeast News Leader. Deshaun Brown joins us now for a look at sports. Yes, sir. A great weekend for one area team. As a matter of fact, when we come back, find out which team has earned its way into the coach's poll. Plus, this former high school football player has been kicking it in Hollywood. Find out who he is and what he's been up to after this. Well, for most high school football players, their dream is to make it to the big stage. It's the same dream held by one Marshall Hilliard, a former player at Memorial Day School. It's the stage that's a little different. Let's go, baby! This is Marshall Hilliard taking in the scene. I mean, two back-to-back -back state championships, that's phenomenal. Once part of the Blue Thunder football team years ago, Hilliard never experienced the state title, but here's the kicker. He's still very much a part of the scene. Laney? Hi! Over the years, he's held reoccurring roles on soaps like Guiding Lights and The Young and the Restless, among other shows. Why don't you shows. take a good look at it now that it's one of my father's many possessions? And says Hilliard, if you think about it, it kind of all works together. Football and acting. He says having skills from each have come in handy. Football psychology is very important because it's what they see sometimes, uh, not necessarily what the ball is. And then, of course, there's this. I always got my shirt off, man. <laughs> it is. It's like the locker room, you know? It's like a uh, scene for Marshall Hilliard. Uh, let me guess. My shirt's off. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I'll use it. What the heck? <laughs> Still using his football skills in the CFL as a semi-pro kicker, Hilliard may not have that high school state title under his belt, but he's still found a way to win. Love it. It's tough, but I make time because football is very important to me. Uh, acting is. Acting is my career. Football is my hobby, but there's nothing I love more. You can't handle me. You can't touch me. And while we are on the topic of high school football, here goes a look at this week's Super 11.